What if I told you that you could help your family lead healthier lives with no extra time, work, or money? I bet you would want to do that. Hi, my name is Diane Lewis, and I'm a mom and a doctor. I founded the Great Healthy Yard Project to give us all a way to work together and make vast improvements on our water quality and our family's health simply by not using conventional pesticides, weed killers, and fertilizers on our yards and gardens. Each year in America, about 80 million pounds of pesticides are used on 30 million acres of lawns. When we put these chemicals on our lawns and gardens, some are absorbed into our groundwater aquifer and some are carried by rainwater as runoff pollution. The chemicals then wash into our streams, our lakes, and our reservoirs. Together, these comprise the sources of our drinking water and tests have shown that lawn chemicals are in much of the water supply. The first ever National Rivers and Streams Assessment performed by the Environmental Protection Agency and released in 2013 found enough fertilizer in more than half of the water nationwide and up to 71% in the East and Midwest that it was deemed of poor quality to support life. The United States Geological Survey released a study in 2013 revealing that all of the streams, rivers, lakes, and fish, and one half of the well water had pesticides. So in essence, by contaminating the water we drink, these chemicals find their way into our own bodies as well as our children's. In a recent study, 44% of the people tested had the weed killer glyphosate in their blood. We now know that very small amounts of pesticides can adversely affect human health, causing problems as diverse as autism, ADHD, diabetes, and cancer. None of us would ever put these chemicals directly in our children's drinking water, but in effect, that is what we are doing. The answer is simple. If we don't put these chemicals on our yards, they will not be in our water. Our yards together contain most of the land in the United States. Together, we can make a difference. Join us. Take the pledge to take care of your yard without synthetic pesticides, weed killers, or fertilizers. Our yards, our children, our responsibility. For more information or to get involved, please visit thegreathealthyyardproject.com.